Hey guys, what is up? Today I will be doing a female hygiene video and everything you need to know about it. My name is Mani Naomi. And without further ado, let's get into the video. So first thing I want to talk about is your skincare. Um, I used to have really bad acne. Um, I will try to insert some clips if I have some. I don't really know. I didn't like taking pictures when I had acne. But my face has really cleared up. I've been doing a lot of things um, to help with that and I'm going to tell you guys about it. So um, first thing I would recommend is drinking water. Water resolves everything. Um, it cleanses your face, it cleanses your pores. Um, also, eat lots of fruit because fruits help also. Um, like eating junk food, hot Cheetos, chocolate, all that will not help with your skin because that's just sweets and oils clogging up your pores. Um, I'm sorry if you guys can hear the rain. I don't know if you guys can, but yeah. Um, next, I also use alcohol on my face sometimes. Like when I have like blemishes, I put alcohol on it. Like I take a little cotton swab and I put alcohol on my face to clear up the bumps quicker. Um, next thing I use... Oh my gosh, I think it's hailing outside. Oh. The wipes. I personally don't wear makeup, but I do wear lashes. You guys can check them out on my website, which will be linked down below. These are exotic. They're $7.99, so check it out. But I use makeup wipes to clean up the, um, to clean all the access glue and everything off of my eyelashes because you don't know, like, where they're manufactured or any of that. Um... I'm trying to think of anything else I need to talk about for your skincare. Oh, when you're finished, like, doing all of that, like, when you finish cleaning your face, um, doing that, you can use coconut oil. This is fractionated coconut oil. Um, that just means it's, like, watery. It's not, um, it's not the thick coconut oil, so... Last thing I use in my face that I'll be talking about today is African Black Soap. This is a clarifying mud mask. It looks like this. I've used a lot of it. I need to stock up on more. But um, it has no parabens, no foliates, no mineral oil, no sulfates, and no animal testing. This is really good. I'm really not sure if this is the real, co um, the real African Black Soap because... Um, I watch a lot of other videos in the real African black soap. The real African black soap um, has brown speckles in it and it's kind of light brown too. So I'm not sure if that's the real one, but that's what I use. Um, next thing I want to talk about is hair. Um, my hair is currently in a bun right now. It looks like this. But the stuff I use in my hair, I use a lot of stuff to like grow my hair out. My hair is about like right here. Um, when I stretch it out, but I've been using aloe juice. This is real aloe juice. It's holy. It's pure. It's filtered. It's an aloe vera juice dietary supplement. It works really well on your hair. All you have to do is put it on your hair, um, leave it on for about 30 minutes, and then go wash your hair out, and it'll help you grow your hair out. Um, I've been trying to grow my hair for three months so far. My hair used to be like right here, and now it's like right here, so... I say it works really well. Next thing I use on my hair is water. You always, you always, I can't talk today. You always need water. Like, you don't ever want to have your hair just dry. Like, if you don't have any type of moisturizer, if you can't afford moisturizer, use water. Um, because if you don't use water, your hair will break off. So. Um, the moisturizer that I use for my hair is hair milk from Carol's Daughter. I don't know if you guys can see that. But check it out. Um, it's pretty thin, but I like it. It's for curls, coils, kinks, and waves, so check it out. It works really well. Um, now we can talk about showering. Um, no, If your skin is sensitive to, like, scented soaps, like Bath and Body Works, um, try using Olay or Dove because those work too. But Bath Body Works has some really bomb scents, so check it out if you're not if your skin isn't sensitive. Um, when you get out of the bath, 
or shower, whichever one you take. I recommend using um, Johnson's Baby Lotion. This is what I use. I always smell really good. I smell like a baby. It works really good. It's moisturizing. But if you want to go with like something stronger scented, and if your skin isn't that sensitive, use something from Bath & Body Works again. This is just the Inner Stars one. I haven't used this in a long time. It has a really strong scent. So this one is just like a regular deodorant. It's Army Hammer. Uh, it's the essential deodorant. It's unscented. Um, but I currently use this one. It is organic. Has 24-hour odor protection, no aluminum, and it is. It smells like coconut oil and Lang Lang. So check it out. It's from Love Beauty and Planet. I don't know if you guys can see that, but that is what I use. Also, when you get out of the shower, if you guys already put on your lotion, your deodorant, and all that, I recommend putting on some perfume. This is also from Bath & Body Works, so check it out. It's called Twisted Peppermint. It smells so good. Next thing is body cream. It's basically the same thing. Um, so yeah, check it out. Um, next thing I want to talk about are, oh, along with like your shower, your face, all that, Use lip gloss um, or lip balm. The things that I currently use on my lips are my Icy Girl lip gloss, which will also be in my shop. I use those two lip glosses, and I also use Birds Bees, so check all those out. Um, each lip gloss that I sell is $1.50. So. Next, for your hair, I forgot to say this for my hair earlier. I use some Australian beeswax for um, my braids and stuff. It's really, I thought, because I was doing my own braids this one night and I thought um, this was like edge wax, but it wasn't. So I've just been using it on my edges and on my ends and it seals your ends and it moisturizes your hair. Um, next thing I want to talk about are your teeth. Um, the current thing is that I use on my teeth. Um, I'll be getting braces soon, so stay tuned also, but I use Crest 3D White. I've been using a lot of it. It looks really flat, but I got it like a couple months ago. Well, not a couple months ago, like a month ago. But, um, next thing I use are these Oral B Complete Glide Scope Outlast Flosses. Um, 150 come in a pack. They work really well. Check them out. You always want to floss your teeth because if you don't floss, like the stuff will be stuck in between your teeth. Um, and the next thing I use is my Oral B Branham toothbrush. It's one of the electric toothbrushes. But I really like it. It works really good. You know, black on my teeth, all that. Next thing I want to talk about is your period. Like, um, I would say I use these. On this tag, they're chlorine free, they're ultra thin, by women, for women. 42 come in here, and I think if this was $9, um, I don't know if I remember. I'll look it up and insert the price, but I'm pretty sure that was $9. And these are just like the usual, always radiant flex foams for like teen girls. You know? um, I personally don't use these because they have a lot of stuff in here that I don't really. I don't know. If you can, check out the organics. Those are really nice. There's no synthetic parasites, no pesticides, no dyes, no fragrances, nothing. Um, so check those out. I forgot to say I want to my teeth. I also use um, Crest 3D Scope. I'm not reading this right. Crest Scope Mouthwash Rinse. Boosh. I don't know why I can't read today, but this is what I use. I'm running low. I need to get some more. This works really well, and it freshens your breath up even more. Last thing I want to talk about is shaving and hair removal. Um, I used to use this. It's in there. It's just the organic kind. I don't like it at all. Um, that's my opinion. I don't like Nair. It stinks. I don't know, I just don't like hair personally, but if you if you don't know how to shave, you don't know how to do 
any of that, use Nair. It's not that bad. Um, make sure you get the sensitive formula because Nair can actually like burn your skin and all that. So that is how I feel about it. But yeah. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.